any new tutorial 2021. Hi guys, today I am showing you how to be productive using AnyDo. AnyDo is an amazing application which helps you to get organized and be productive with your daily life tasks. So let's get started. Now first you have to do is just go to any.do and you will simply sign up for this. They have different plans. You can actually sign up for the free plan as well and you will log into this dashboard. Now AnyDo actually have all of these amazing features that help you get productive and organized with your daily life tasks and even you can actually get organized with your business and work task as well so it's super easy to use and let me show you around so what happens is that you can see right here there are different options for example there is an option of create a task where we will actually create a task i will show you that how you create different tasks on any do and then how you actually schedule them and keep them in check then there is a shortcut option then there is a list option where you can actually create different lists for example your personal list your work list or even your grocery list then there are different tags where you can actually organize your different tasks and your work according to different priority level so let's get started and create a task real quick so what you can do is for example, this was my task and my task is workout. I have a workout routine and I need to be reminded about this. So I want to get this reminder. Let's set up a custom reminder to this. And let's just say that I want to go tomorrow at 8 a.m. So I have set up a time for this and a date. Now what's going to happen is I will simply click on set. So now this routine, my workout has been set and I will be reminded that I have to go on 8 a.m. I have to go for workouts. Let's add a note to and let's just say grab a smoothie on the way in case I forget. So I have added a note for myself which says grab a smoothie on the way. So this is how you know you work on any do. You can simply add any any task you want to and you can just then get organized so i will simply click on add task and now you will see that this is the task for tomorrow if i want to add another task i will simply click on create a task again and add task so after that if i want to create a list for example there is a list that i want to create let's go to work and i will just simply click on work and click on this plus button and here i will be able to name a list for this i'm gonna add my work and and according to my work, let's just say tutorial videos. Okay, create. Once I click on create, you will see that this is the list that has been created. And I will now add my tasks into this list. So my work list is tutorial videos. Now my task should maybe video number one. There you go. You can see that this is the first task that I have added in this list. Now I can add a tag as well. And according to the tags, I can actually have access to one tag right now which is the priority tag and i will simply save it after that i can set a time for this and i will say okay i have to make this video at maybe 10 a.m there you go and i will simply set it after that if i want to get who's the owner of course i am if i want to share a list i can actually you know go ahead and share it with somebody for example if it's a work list i can share it with my other employees or if it's a personal list i can share it with my uh, family members or other people for example if you are a man you can share it with your wife or your kids so you you know it's a simple simple workspace where you actually get organized and be productive and that's what we need nowadays and that's actually pretty amazing you have access to all of these cool features on your mobile phone or your desktop so uh, for now i'm just gonna dismiss this and after that i'm gonna just go ahead and save all of these changes if i want to delete the task i will simply click on delete task if i want to mark it as done so i can mark Mark it as done and it will be you know check off the list this is you know um how they have you know crossed the task this actually you know uh, makes you feel like you're working on your personal diary so of course this is the task number one if i want to create another task i can just go ahead and add another task into this list and i will simply click right here and now the second task is also added and i can just go ahead and repeat the process that i did earlier so this is how you create different lists in your work you add different tasks into a list after that you saw the option of tags if i want to create a new tag for now you can see that this is 
available for the premium for example if i go to uh, this is actually the pricing for any do that we just you know came across so let me show you around that this is the you know you get one month of uh, any do for six dollars then there's a most popular plan which is for 12 months which is 2.99 per month and you can actually save up to 50 percent and then there is a six month plan which is for five dollars and you can save up to 25 percent so it's very cheap you can see right here that only for three dollars you can actually get a 12 months plan so that's pretty amazing for now i'm just gonna leave it and the good thing about any do is that you can actually integrate a lot of other features as well for example you can integrate google calendar you can integrate your whatsapp you can integrate other things as well so if i click on calendar you can see right here they're saying that connect with the google calendar if i will simply click on connect with google they will actually you know allow me to go and integrate google calendars into my any do so that's pretty good because when it comes to uh, being organized and being scheduled being on time calendars are very important i will simply click on my google account and they will allow me to integrate my google calendar with my any do simply click on continue and there you go it literally took one minute to integrate my google calendar into my any do and this is how you can actually do that as well after that you can see this is my profile i can simply click right here and actually add an image for my profile as well so let me grab something and add into it for now let's just add this image there you go my image also has been added now you will see that this is very easy to use you get shortcuts you get list you will actually you know see all of your different tasks for example for today you will click on today and you will be able to see your tasks for today then there is next seven days then there is all tasks where you will be able to check all of your tasks after that guys you can see right here that you can actually you know go ahead and add your ghost list as well so if i click right here i can actually add my list and you can just simply you know so you can see right here that you can create your ghost list as well on your any do and once you're done with any of the product you can simply check it out and you'll be like okay i have bought this now i'm just gonna so it's pretty easy to use when you're holding your mobile phone and you will have this app on your mobile phone which allows you to do all of these amazing uh things so, so it becomes really easy to be productive and uh be more organized in your daily life so you can see the option of settings right here if i go to settings i will be able to go to my profile integrations if i go to integrations let me show you around that you can see you can integrate up to 3000 apps on your any do you can see right here that these are different apps that are available for any do check this out guys you can actually integrate your slack your trello when it comes to work and when it comes to you know simple apps you can actually you know integrate your whatsapp or you can integrate what microsoft to do google assistant so that's pretty amazing how any do lets you do anything you can actually do anything on any do that's what they actually stand for so yeah you can integrate if i go to settings again you will see the theme background if you want to change the background you can just simply click on any of this image and your background will be changed then there is a desktop notification option and default list of course uh, for the theme if you want to go dark you can simply go dark theme if you like you know dark themes um so that's actually pretty good i'm gonna keep this one then there is a notification option where you actually see all of your different notifications again in the dark theme you can again change your background image as i did so this is how any do actually works it's it's pretty easy to use you create lists you create uh, different tasks for your work as well you can create tags you can then check these tasks and lists according to your needs so yeah guys this brings us to the end of the video i hope that i was a big help to you and now you will be able to be more productive using any do make sure to give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to the youtube channel